Hey y'all, hey! April Bishop here. I am a 10K affiliate with My Daily Choice Hemp Works. So I always want to put that out there first because that's what I do. But I am here today to educate you guys on the power of using quality CBD and what to look for in a quality CBD. Again, guys, just to tell you a little bit about myself, my name is April Bishop. I actually went on a journey looking for CBD for epilepsy. I suffer with epilepsy, and let me make this clear. I don't make any medical claims. That's just my journey and my personal experience and the thing that draw me to seek out the power of hemp and CBD. So I just wanted to, I had to throw that out there. Throw it out there. I need to let you know what I do, and I need to let you know why I even started looking for the CBD option in the first place. So that's my story. And I was, and it basically came down to the point of me wanting to get off of harsh medications that was altering who I really am. And that was just an alternative that I found so many amazing results on. So if you're wondering what CBD can do for you, I challenge you, I, I double dog dare you just to go to Google Google CBD and whatever ailment that you or a loved one may be suffering with. So do that for yourself. But I'm here to talk about the quality of CBD. And the thing that brought me to it, I was just talking to a customer or someone who became a customer of mine today um, about CBD. And when we were having the conversation about uh, what, it, what it could be used for, what does it help with, uh, I got her to Google her condition, see some of the results, and see some of the research and information out there. So she told me after we after we went through all of that that she already had some CBD at home. I was like, okay, can you please go get the bottle? Let's check it out. I just want to make sure that you're using something that's going to be effective. Because I already had asked her if she tried it before. She said yes. Uh, it did not work as she thought it should have worked or what she was expecting. So... After she went and got the bottle, I asked if she could turn it around and just read me the instructions. Read me the instructions on the bottle. That's all I want to see right now. Let me see the instructions. So she started reading out some things that she couldn't even pronounce, guys. Because, you know, it was, you know how it is when you're looking at labels. Some of the stuff is kind of difficult. So she's looking at the bottle. She's reading it back to me. Um, it did have coconut oil in it, grapeseed oil. It had all these different ingredients in CBD. I'm like... But you wanted CBD oil. You wanted hemp oil. So that's probably why it wasn't as effective for her because I get so many people who say, I've tried CBD and it did not work for me. I did not see a difference. But did you check the label? The label tells it all. When you're looking for a CBD oil, it needs to have nothing but hemp or CBD oil in it, not grapeseed oil, not coconut oil. So that goes to my first point. Make sure that the CBD brand you choose is not filled with fillers. And not that coconut oil or grapeseed oil or all these oils aren't good for you, but it's not CBD oil. It's not hemp oil. So they're filling it with fillers so you're getting, a less, you're getting less quality and an inferior product. So make sure that it doesn't have no more than two or three ingredients. I'm just going to read the ingredients off of mine here. And this one I take every day. I just switched up flavors. This one is the strawberry guava, but my favorite is still the watermelon mint. That's my absolute favorite. So let's look at these uh, ingredients. Okay. Pressed hemp seed oil. Hemp derived full spectrum CBD. Really? Natural flavors. I told y'all it's strawberry guava. Natural flavors and stevia leaf. That's it, guys. No coconut oil, no grapeseed oil, nothing additional in this product that's besides the CBD and the hemp. And of course, a little flavor. And so you got to give it a little flavor. Um, but it's not even about the taste because the taste don't matter when you're taking pain or when you're healing your body. So that's the first thing. Make sure that label got what you're looking for. If you want some grapeseed oil, then you can go get some grapeseed oil. If you want some coconut oil, you can go get you some coconut oil. But if you pay for CBD, make sure you're getting CBD and hemp oil. Okay, guys, the next thing, the color. If you got the CBD and it's clear or it's light yellow, the quality probably isn't there. That's CBD if it's pure. It's going to be greenish. It's going to be gold. Hold on, let me show you. I got it right here for a reason so I can show you guys better than I can tell you. 
I had to squeeze on this one because this one's mine. Look at this, guys. Look at the color on that. Look at the velocity on that. Like, this is a quality CBD oil. It is goldish green. That is the color. I hope y'all can see that okay. Maybe if I put my hand up. Yeah, that's better. So, you see that color? That's what you want to see when you're looking for a quality CBD hemp oil. So, if it's clear or it's light, it ain't right. Remember that. If it's light, it ain't right. So, get you a quality CBD. Also, domestically versus imported, domestic versus import hemp. Now, when I say imported hemp, that's the hemp that has came from another country. Their farming regulations are different from ours. When you grow something in the soil, whatever's being grown in that soil is your, the item, the product that's being grown in that soil is absorbing the toxins in the soil, the impurities in the air. And by other countries having different regulations on farming than we do here in the United States, you don't know what you're getting. It could have heavy metals in it. So guys, it's so important to have a domestic grown hemp. That way, you know there's uh, farming regulations here. So it has to have a certain type of standards. But when it's imported hemp, you really don't know what is in the atmosphere there. And whatever's in that atmosphere is transferred, it's in that plant. And it also, you take that in. So make sure it's domestic hemp. Okay? Third-party testing. Guys, so super important. You want... That's just like you giving the kid the, the take-home test, the open book test. Do you want an open book test when it comes to your health? No. You want somebody that's making it at the highest quality and then having someone else tested a third-party testing. You want to make sure you got a certificate of analysis showing exactly what went into making this particular batch of CBD oil. So that is super, super important. And guys, this CBD here, look, scan that, scan that bar there. Guess where it goes? Directly to the certificate of analysis. Make sure it's accessible. If you got a dig for it, they don't know where it's at. You can't easily ex uh, have the certificate of analysis accessible to you. Think about the product. And last but not least, and certainly so many other things, but I want to, like I said, I want to keep it short, like under 10 minutes. <laughs> so I'm trying my best. Also make sure that it is a U.S. hemp round, hemp authority approved or certified CBD. There's only 13 companies in the U.S. that carry that seal, the U.S. hemp authority certified seal. And as you can see here, this is what it will look like. So if you see that on the product, you know you have one of 13 of the best companies that they are when it comes to the standards and the quality of the CBD. So that's super important, guys. Only 13 companies carry this seal. Only 13. Only. So, guys, like I said, it's so important. Uh, I just want to make sure that I'm not... Because I talk to people a lot about CBD... I try to dispel a lot of misconceptions about CBD. No, it is not illegal. It is not illegal. It does not get you high. It gets you healthy. Guys, stop believing everything you hear. Do some research. I urge you to do some research. Because if you have someone in your family suffering and an oil can help them, a quality, a quality CBD oil can help them, wouldn't you want them to have that relief? So, like I said, I just want to talk to you about the quality of the CBD. I put the information below in the link. So, I'm sorry, in the description. So, if you want to see more videos, because I'm coming with more videos about CBD, misconceptions, the endocannabinoid system. I'm coming with more of them. So, if you want to hear information like that, subscribe, guys. Check out my channel. Check out my page. It's a lot I have here, all health and wellness driven. The longer we're here, the more change we can make. So, we got to take care of this one and only body temple that we have. So, guys, if you have any questions at all, 
You can drop them below. I will get back to them. I check my messages a couple of times a day, and I'll be more than happy to answer any questions you have. And again, my name is April Bishop, just bringing you light, love, health, and wellness. <laughs> and I'll check you out later. Have a good afternoon.